is it's my fourth review. These are the Disney Frozen dolls that I own. Starting from left to right. This is Kristoff with his signature hat, his blonde hair. He is painted on and he has teal painted sh undershirt with his signature top on and his belt. His pants are painted and he has removable boots. This is Anna. She has her pink tiara, her signature red hair with pigtails, her fuchsia pink cape, then she has a hardened top on that is black with the signature rose melon print on it. She also has a blue undershirt that's painted on. The only thing that's removable on her is her skirt that is blue, royal blue with the signature rose melon roses on the bottom and she has black boots. This one is Elsa and she has her signature blue tiara followed by her platinum white blonde hair that's braided. She also has her undergarment painted with the snowflakes painted on her arm. Her dress is removable. It has glitter around the top of it that is white followed by her teal colored dress and her skirt has blue aqua colored snowflakes going down it. I got her at Walmart and Anna and Kristoff all three of them at Walmart. They are sold out and they are not in stock but you can find them on Amazon.com. I personally like Elsa and Anna both. They look better to me than the Disney Store versions. The Disney Store versions are what others think, in their opinion, more precise to the real movie version. But to me, the Mattel version look better. Their eyes on Kristoff to the right is brown, followed by Anna's blue eyes that are white, that are very widely open in her pink lipstick. And then there are Elsa's who are wide, that look like cat eyes, and her pink lipstick. Each one of these was about $12 to $13 a piece. Please leave positive feedback and or comments. And thank you for viewing my video on the Kristoff, Anna, and Elsa dolls. They're all Mattel version, not Disney Store version.